Gravity is a pretty heavy film, but is it science reality or science fiction? Hey everyone, Trace here, exploring the world of gravity for DNews. In case you have somehow missed it, one of the most visually intricate space movies ever created is set to come out this weekend, Alfonso Cuaron's Gravity. I haven't seen it yet, but from the trailers and stuff, it looks pretty freaking incredible. Gravity takes place in space, ironically, where gravity itself has the weakest grip. I see what you did there, Cuaron. Gravity is still a theory, because we're still learning how it's generated and why it exists. But regardless, we all know that it's pretty damn important. We stand the ground because of it, the moon remains in orbit because of it, the planets stay around the sun because of it, universes, you get the idea. But gravity takes that to a whole different level by simulating the Kessler syndrome. One piece of junk hits another piece of junk, causing more flying junk, hitting exponentially more stuff. It's real bad. To get an insider's look of how gravity plays out on the screen, we talk to actual shuttle astronaut and Hubble Space Telescope engineer, Mike Massimino. Mike, how was the movie? Well, I'm not a critic or anything, Trace, but uh, I, I kind of liked it. They start off at the Hubble Space Telescope, and that, my missions were to the Hubble and they put a lot of detail to make sure that it looked just like our Hubble flight. I think the uh, movie makers studied our IMAX Hubble 3D movie. The tools are exact, the payload exact. In fact, again, I'm one of only maybe 11 people I would notice this. I was looking for stuff in the payload bay was there. I'm like, I wonder if they did this, I wonder if they did that. They had everything, they had every little detail. When the disaster happens, with it, you can see in the trailer, yeah. would she just go flying like that? I remember before my very first flight, our instructors give you like a, a blooper reel. I'm like, don't let this happen to you. But there have been cases where astronauts, you know, lose their grip or launch themselves off of something by mistake and they don't realize what they're doing. And then all of a sudden they start tumbling. I always had like, oh, it'd be really bad if you're tumbling. You know, you'd see Earth and then space, Earth and then space, wow. Earth and then space. I always had the confidence that no matter what was happening out there, we were going to take care of each other and get get each other to safe. Right. How much oxygen is there in a regular EVA suit? Well, uh, I think we generally, we more or less look at these, how much time you have left. And you're, good, you're good for another, in, uh, probably about another six or seven, eight hours. To so say you took a hit and went through the spacesuit and entered the pressure layer, which is keeping you alive, the ex secondary oxygen pack will kick on. That's when you figure you have about 30 minutes to get inside. See, is there like an astronaut lifeboat? Is there a rescue system? There's always a Soyuz, two Soyuz use spacecraft uh, yeah. double for you to use so if you have a crew of six you put three in one and three in the other and you call it a day and come home so it was very it was accurate you know they have I don't want to give away the movie but if you've seen the trailer we, they're kind of having a bad day so that's a pretty like you know we we had little things go wrong but you know they had they didn't have a bad day they had a very bad day in space you know you, you see space upon the big screen and the beauty of it i think this movie although it's maybe not intended to do that i think it's going to inspire a lot of young people as well it shows the beauty of space and so we're you know still doing stuff in space and, and uh, I, I think it's going to inspire a lot, a lot of people as well to, to learn more about the space program so what did you think do you want to see the movie you don't want to see the movie let us know down in the comments and make sure you subscribe for more d news